Hello, Russia. Hello, my name is Michael. Today we're going to be taking some lung function tests called a spirometry test. Okay. So before we do this, I'm going to run through uh, a spirometry questionnaire with you. Okay. Could you please tell me yes or no to these questions? In the past three months, have you had any surgery or on your chest or on your abdomen? No. Have you had a heart attack in the past three months? No. Do you have a detached retina or have you had eye surgery in the past three months? No. Have you been hospitalized for any other heart condition within the past month? I haven't. Are you in the last trimester of pregnancy? No. Let me just check your pulse, please. Are you currently taking any medication for tuberculosis? No. Okay. Do you know of any reason why we should not conduct spirometry on you today? No. Okay. Have you had a, a respiratory infection or a cold in the past three weeks? No, I haven't. Okay. And have you taken any medications for your breathing in the last 24 hours? No. I would normally record your height and your weight and your hip and waist, okay? But I'm not going to do that right now. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to measure your lung function using a thing called a spirometer, okay? So I'm going to use this device, I'm going to use these mouthpieces, a sterile clean mouthpiece, single use, mouth use mouthpiece. I'm going to fit the mouthpiece to the device, enter some information in here on your your age and your height and your sex uh, and your ID number. Then I'm going to ask you to blow through the machine. And the machine will measure the volume of air that you push out from your lungs and how fast you can do that and various other, other measurements. Okay? We'll do this multiple times until I'm satisfied that we've got good enough readings. Uh, a minimum of three times. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you some inhaler, some bronchodilator. Okay, it's a medicine that can open up your airways. Okay. We'll use this device here. It's a, an aerosol chamber. Okay. It's just for hygiene purposes, really. Um, so we'll attach the, the inhaler to the chamber, mm -hmm. and then you will take the medicine, inhale the medicine through the chamber, down into your lungs. Okay. We'll wait 15 minutes, and we'll repeat, repeat the test again, and we'll see if there's any improvement or any change in your lung function. Uh, as a result of taking the medication. Okay? Now, when we are doing this test, I would very much like you to sit up nice and straight the whole time, your back against the back of the chair, and your head up. Okay? I'd like you to keep your legs out in front of you. Okay? okay? Mm -hmm. And try not to bend over as you're breathing out okay. through, through the machine. It gets very, very tempting when you're pushing out your air. You're going to be blasting this air out of your lungs bend over. Okay. Try and remember to keep your back against the back of the chair and sit up nice and straight. And keep your eyes open for me. Yeah. So I can make sure that you're fully aware of your surroundings and what you're doing. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to input some information into the machine and then I'm going to demonstrate the blow to you. Okay. So just put your ID in. I'm not going to enter your name into the machine just for your confidentiality reasons. Could I ask your age, please? I'm 33. Your height? 1.2. Your weight? 50 kilograms. Your female? Are you a smoker? No. Have you ever been a smoker? Never. No. Do you have asthma? No. Okay. So the machine now has your information in it. All we need to do is get you to blow through the machine. I'm going to demonstrate that maneuver to you now. So this is the mouthpiece. I'll have another one for you. Okay. And essentially what I'm going to do is fit the mouthpiece into the machine. 
You see on the mouthpiece it has little grooves. These are for your teeth. Okay, so it illustrates that you have to physically put the mouthpiece into your mouth. Okay. Now, when I say they're for your teeth, I do not want you to bite and crush the mouthpiece, like so. Okay. Just take a gentle grip. Okay, so it's in your mouth, these are your teeth, gentle grip. Okay. Your lips make a seal around, mm -hmm. so that no air is escaping. And I will also give you a little single-use nose clip as well, so that all of the air that you're going to take in, is all going to go down through this tube. Okay, there's no air will escape anywhere else. Okay, so just to demonstrate. Okay. Okay, I'm going to ask you to take as deep a breath as you possibly can. Legs out in front, sitting nice back straight. So, take the machine from me. Put the mouthpiece in and blast out. Real forceful blast. And keep going, forcing the air out of your lungs. Okay, until I say stop. Okay, so it's going to be like... Keep on going. Keep on going until I say stop. Okay. All the t all the time you're blowing out, you'll be fine. All the time we're blowing out, I uh, I will be trying to encourage you to keep forcing that air out. Okay, and keep going for as long as you can. Okay. It's not passive. You're not. <sighs> it is. <sighs> really push the air out of your lung. Yeah. Okay. I'll just get you a nice clean one of these now. As you can see, I'm going to open from the opposite end from the mouthpiece, so I'm not handling the mouthpiece. <coughs> Are you happy with the technique, the way, that, the way that I've explained the technique yeah. to you? Yes. Okay. Fine. And that's just to sit on the nose? That's to sit on your nose, okay. yes. So if you want to take those from me, and you place them over your nostril, so your nostrils are blocked. You look fine. Okay. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. Take a nice big deep breath in for me now. Machine. And blast out. That's it. And keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep remaining back in the chair. Keep going, keep going. Well done. Was yeah. that all right? That's fine, thank you. When you're ready, we'll have another go. Another one? Yes, please. Okay, all right. Okay, so exactly the same again. Here we go. Take a deep breath in. And blast off! <laughs> That's it. Keep going, 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 keep going. Push, 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 push. Well done. Okay, you can take the nose clip off. Okay. Very good, very reproducible. I'm going to give it another go when you're ready. As I said before, there's a minimum of three hours okay. before I give you the medicine. Fantastic. All right, you're ready to go. There we go. Okay, are you ready? I'm ready. So start taking a big deep breath in now, deep, deep as you can, and blast out. <laughs> That's it, and keep going. Push, 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 all that air out. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Well done. Thank you. Fantastic. Excellent. So that's us finished with the pre bronchodilator test. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Rishi, thank you for that. What we're going to do now is I'm going to give you some of the bronchodilator. Okay. I'm going to give you two puffs of that. Okay. And then we're going to wait 15 minutes and we'll conduct the test again. Okay. So, this is the spacer device that we use for hygiene reasons. Okay. okay it's a single use device, so what I'll do is. Bronchodilator in there. Okay. okay. Then I can depress the button. The medicine will go into the chamber. And what I'll ask you to do is take, put the mouthpiece in your mouth. Inhale. So you take deep down into your lungs. You're taking all of that medication. Okay. Then I want you to hold your breath for 10 seconds, and I'll count that with you. Okay. okay. As we're counting, we can remove this from your mouth, but I want you to close your lips. Okay. And on the count of 10, then you can exhale and breathe normally. Okay. okay. And then yeah. we'll do it again. Okay. Alright. And I don't need the nose clip. No. <coughs> okay. Just make sure it's working. Okay. So, are you ready? I am, yes. Okay, so you take that, 
big deep breath in. Hold on. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Breathe. Okay. So wait for about thirty seconds. And then I'll give you another shot. It should be absolutely fine. Some people a little bit light lightheaded or a little bit of heart palpitations. So if you notice those things, just let me know. But it's not uncommon. Okay? Yeah, there's nothing to worry okay. about. Okay. Okay, let's go again. Big deep breath in. Sit down, hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, breathe. So these are single use, so these are disposed of now. Okay. Now we'll wait 15 minutes, and then we'll do the test. Okay. The same test. The okay, Risha. Well, we've had 15 minutes now. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to measure your post bronchodilator spirometry. Okay. I'm just going to indicate that we have successfully uh, completed the pre bronchodilator test. Okay. okay. So are you ready to have? Your first go post bronchial delivery. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. I'm just going to block the spirette so the machine can take a new baseline reading. I'm now going to toggle across to the post option. Okay. okay, so we're not adding to the pre bronchial delivery, but we're creating a post bronchial delivery uh, data file. Okay. okay, so when you're ready. machine off me and a big big blast now. That's it. Keep going, 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 keep going. Well done. Excellent. Okay. Need at least two more efforts. Two more, okay. I'm ready. Okay. So nice big breath in. And blast. So keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, you're doing really well. Fantastic, well done. Okay, a minimum of one more. Okay, just whenever you're ready. If you need a little rest, that's fine. Okay, I'm good to go, I'm okay. ready. Okay, there we go, so nice deep breath in. Take the machine and blast out. <laughs> And keep going, 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 keep going. Well done. Okay. Okay. We've got an A. We got an A on the pre and an A on the post. Well done. Okay. I'm just going to go across to crit, and that now is that information saved on the machine. Okay. I'm also going to record on the questionnaire that we have acceptable post bronchial spirometry, and that there were no adverse events.